Welcome, welcome to Volatility 411 for Equity Armor Investments. I'm Joe Tige, the Portfolio Manager of the Rational Equity Armor Fund. We're looking at a market that's down small in the S&P 500, uh, a little bit worse than the NASDAQ, and of course the VIX is just a little bit higher. Now this morning, when the market was higher, we actually saw the VIX bottoming out at 15.38. Now that's pretty low for the VIX, given where we've been lately. In spite of the fact that we've making new all-time highs, the VIX had trouble getting below 20, then had trouble getting below 18. Now that we're uh, making a new all-time high and maybe uh, maybe kind of stalling here, it's seemingly the VIX is now coming in, and maybe it has to do with the volatility is not quite there to the upside anymore. Uh, maybe some consolidation is going to be taking place. Case in point, I've been watching earnings lately, and you go back the past four quarters, uh, anything positive out of companies, uh, street love. They, they just race after these companies after earnings. Uh, they just said, you know, next year we're going to do better or, you know, better luck next time. Uh, and these PEs have just been climbing and climbing. Now that we're really close to a full economy getting out there, uh, companies are having a little bit harder time with earnings. The street's holding their feet to the cold. And if you have a bad report, if you uh, have a bad guidance, stocks are getting pummeled. And if you have a really good report, stocks aren't getting rewarded the same way that they used to. So maybe that's uh, actually bringing in the volatility now that, uh, there's a little bit less vol to the upside. Uh, I always look at the SKU index. This is uh, something else interesting to me. That's starting to come lower, so people are paying less for downside protection. That's a part of volatility coming lower. If we want to be contrarian about there, maybe uh, maybe that's a sign that people are a little complacent. I'll be watching that. The VIX, of course, I always watch that too. That's the volatility of the futures, the VIX futures. Uh, that's 105, so certainly a little bit of an increase there. People are expecting uh, the VIX futures to have a little bit of movement. We'll be watching how that plays out as the Fed is saying they're not so worried about inflation. They're more worried about deflation. Take that however you want to take it, but uh, that should mean rates should come lower, and that should be good for equities. For Equity Armor Investments, I'm Joe Teague.